Hey guys, Kiersey Snyder here, ready to rock for Teachable Tuesday. It's the 23rd of January. So if you're catching the replay from Teachable Tuesday replays.com, please put replay in the comments below. And then the document we go over tonight is going to be in the description right underneath this video. So be sure to check that out. If you want access to it, you can print it out. You can mark it up. You can put notes on it. Whatever works for you is great. Thank you for taking the time to catch the replay. And we are going to let everyone in now and then we'll get rocking. Congrats on being here. Boom. There we go. A couple minutes late today, guys, but for all good reasons. So welcome, welcome, welcome. Good to have you guys here. Awesome. Good to see ya. Go. Boom. Yeah, rocking and rolling. <clears throat> all right. Man, I'm excited. We got some uh we got some good stuff planned for tonight. That is all I can say is we got some good stuff planned for tonight. So hope you guys are fired up. Hope you guys are excited. Hope you guys are in a spot where you could pay attention and take notes because uh, we have a lot of good, good, good things going on tonight. And we're going to share that with you, give you guys the step-by-step -step, play by play, all that good stuff. So just get ready to learn and uh, get rolling. Uh, Chaos, anything before we get rolling here? Nope. We should be good to go. Um, you're recording on your end. So just make sure that it's on speaker mode or just pin me just so the replay can see better. Copy that. Cool. All right. So first and foremost, you guys, if you started within the last 30 days, put the word 30 in the chat, the number 30. Okay. Um, Mariah Brown to the punch. Love it. Who else is brand new? We got Shannon Ray. Uh, wow. Okay. Lots of new people. Good job. Can't even keep up with the comments. Have you gone into the fast start guide yet? Just put fast start guide. If you have. Yes. Okay. Good. Vanessa. Awesome. Ray, Mariah, all you guys, good. Rick, keep it coming in, guys. Awesome. You've gone through the fast start guide. So I just want to do a very like two second, maybe two minute recap of what Mindset Monday talked about yesterday. Okay. Mindset Monday specifically went into it basically a mini orientation for what you can expect within TFT. Okay. Starts out with the overview, then it goes into the app setup. If you guys were there for Mindset Monday, what are the main couple things that the app is for? Drop a comment real fast. Let me know. What's the app used for? What's the intent? Why is that like the first thing that we want you to go do when you are in the funnel team training? Why does it matter? Drop me a comment. Let me know. Lead sales learning. Yep. You can get leads in real time. You can close sales in real time and you can earn and learn on the go. Incorporate that into your short form video. Earn and learn on the go. You want to earn from your phone. You want to earn from the mobile device that you're watching this video on right now. Connect with me, right? And then it goes into the fast start guide, part one, fast start guide, part two. As a very, very teeny little baby recap of fast start guide, the GoDaddy domain that you purchase, workwithlori.com, okay, whatever it is, the domain that you purchase is hooked to your funnel team URL. The URL that's long, the funnel team, it has a bunch of numbers on it, blah, blah, blah. And it has your G few username at the end, right? You follow me so far? The GoDaddy domain that you purchased, like workwithellen.com, succeedwithsim.com, whatever it is you chose, that is the link that you will use in your content for the call to action, which is the last piece of the four-point formula that's in Fast Start Guide Part 2. It is not where you are putting out your funnel team link that's long, that has a lot of words and numbers and such in it. It is specifically your GoDaddy domain that you're going to be using when someone wants information, when they want to watch the funnel, right? They want the video from the funnel, those types of things. Does that make sense? Yes or no? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Any questions Let me chime in quickly super on quick. that? Yeah, go ahead. Guys, 100% make sure that you guys are taking notes because uh, Kirstie already dropped a really big bomb. And yeah, obviously leading you guys into what we're going to share with you guys tonight. But one of the most important things she already said was, do you want to have the ability to earn while you learn? That's a question that I would just like to see every single one of you make a piece of content tonight and or tomorrow with that phrase leading off your videos as a hook. Every single one of you should literally lead that off as a hook because that is an awesome, awesome, awesome line. And 
that's just scratching the surface of all the content that we're going to give you guys and examples tonight in tonight's training. But that is a great line that you guys should be writing down, making a note and using it because it's awesome. Yep. Earn and learn on the go. Earn from the device you're watching this video from right now. Someone finds you on Facebook Reels. Someone finds you on TikTok. You need to tie it down to the convenience of earning literally from the phone they're watching you on. Does that make sense? And also make sure you guys are on mute. Daniel, if you can mute people as well, that would help. Um, as we dive into things tonight, first, we're going to give you access to the script for our brand new video sales letter. The reason that's important is because when someone sees a piece of content from you, from Facebook Reels, Instagram, TikTok, whatever, if it is similar to then what they go see when they go to your funnel, it's going to be collaborative for them. It's going to be recognized for them. It's a way of branding. It's also a way for it to be where it is overlapping. So what you're saying to have someone want to go to your funnel is then translated in the video sales letter that they go see. Okay. The video sales letter is brand spanking new. It's brand new. As of last Wednesday, we talked about on focus Friday last week, a couple uh, days ago, right? It's about 20, 21 minutes long total. We added in about a minute and a half today at around minute 16 to do more tie down for you so that the person watching could be like, okay, I'm ready to enroll with SIM. I understand everything that I'm getting. Holy crap, I've got to do it now, right? If you haven't watched that video sales letter yet, what you would do is go into the fast start guide, the GoDaddy setup section where you have that link where you paste your GFoo username at the end so it goes to you, you get the commission. Go watch that video sales letter tonight because what we're going to go over right now is the script of that video sales letter. Does that make sense? Another thing to tell yourself and to tell other people and in your content would be that our training, our system, our funnels does the selling and telling for you. It does it for you. If you were to say that in your short form video content, not just say, oh, I'll handle the techie stuff. But if you were to say, my funnels convert, I'll give them to you instantly for free. Let that do the selling and telling for you. That way you can lock in weekly paychecks. You can have daily sales anywhere between 20 bucks to $400. You want $400 a sale? Drop me a comment. You want $400 a sale? Go to workwithdavid.com. You know what I'm saying? Does that make sense so far? Let me know. Just drop the word yes if that makes sense so far. And yes, just like Daniel said, I hope you're taking notes because I am on fire tonight. (laughs) Short form videos is like my jam. It is the thing I can just roll in for like three hours and get like 300 pieces of content. Not kidding. So make sure that you're taking notes. Anything that stands out, if you were to think of it from the lead perspective, from Billy Bob, who just happens to see your video on TikTok, what would Billy Bob want to hear? That he's taken care of. This is why it matters. Why does he want the funnels done for him? Tie it down. Do you guys get what I mean when I say tie it down? You can't just say, I'll do the funnels for you. Who cares? What makes you stand out? Oh, I'll handle the email sequencing. What does that even mean? What is email sequencing? Do do people know? You probably know, maybe. But when I first started out, I didn't even know what GoDaddy.com was. Let me So tie it down uh, for them. Sorry, let me do a little foreshadowing here. And this is, I want you to key in on something because- exactly what Kiersey is saying right now. Like, do they even know what that means? Oh, we have done for you sales funnels. Like, who cares? What does that mean? When you watch the VSL, when you read the script, okay, you will notice. And and now that I tell you this, you're going to pay way more attention. You're going to, and then you're going to realize how many times I actually do it through the whole VSL. And it's a lot. I lost count. But when I state something like we do all the email marketing for you, Right after that line, I will transition into saying something like, we'll do all the email marketing for you, meaning you don't have to worry about clunky autoresponders, paying for an autoresponder, API integration, HTML code, or having to figure out all that techie crap out for you. We got your back. We'll add stuff like that in. And all throughout the VSL, I'll say things like, you don't have to do this, meaning, and then I explain what I just Mm -hmm. said. Right. So 
pay attention to that because that's really important. And you can, again, you can literally clone that same exact stuff in your content. Yep. You always want to tie it down. You don't want to just say, oh, you get this. Well, who cares? <laughs> you want to tie it down so that the person who sees your content for the very first time wants to take action in that moment. You're not, here's a bomb for you guys. Your content, whether you started a week ago, yesterday, this morning, or two years ago, your content, every single time you put something out should be with intention to grab a new eyeball, a new person, not worrying about, oh, well, they saw that same kind of thing yesterday. You don't want fence sitters. You don't want someone who's like, oh, I've been watching you for like seven years, <laughs> you know? Yeah, you'll have those too as you're consistent and it's awesome. It gives you longevity. It gives you posture. But think of your short form videos to be the gateway, the gatekeeper, the preface, right? Your trailer to the movie of why they want to attend the movie. Why do they want to work with you? Are you tying it down well enough to have them be like, out of everyone on this platform, she's the one who stands out because she explained it in a way that I didn't understand yet. Does that make sense, guys? Always be thinking about tie downs. How can you explain it to a brand new person and make them want to take action the day they see your content instead of trying to talk to all these people who are fence sitting? Make sense? Yes or no? Let me know. Okay, so I'm going to share my screen. Actually, is it going to let me? Oh, yes, it is. Good. <laughs> uh, let me pull this up. Um, for those on the replay, you guys will have access to this underneath the description right below this video if you're on teachabletuesdayreplays.com. So be sure to use it to your advantage. Okay. Um, let me share now. Just drop a two in the chat as soon as you can see my screen. And then I'm going to dissect this for you guys. Okay. And you're going to get the drift of this really quickly, but I also want you to understand even if we did not teach on this tonight, even if we just said, here's the script, how about it? Oh, listen, if you trust yourself, if you trust what's laid out in front of you, if you trust that you're made for more, you would be able to look at a script like this, take the concepts of what you learned from Fast Start Guide Part 1 and 2, the four-point formula for how to do videos, why the four pieces are important, and you would be able to do exactly what we're going to teach tonight, even if we never taught it. But it comes down to trusting yourself. Some of you guys had messaged me. I'll just, here's a tangent real fast. Some of you guys have messaged me over the last, say, week, and you're stressed out. You might be brand new. You might have been here for three months, maybe two years, whatever else. And you're like, I just don't know what I'm doing. I'm trying really hard. What does this mean? I went to this piece. I don't get it. Blah, blah, blah. Right. And what it comes down to is how confident you are in yourself. You have to act as if you trust yourself. You trust yourself to understand it. You trust that you will understand it. You trust that it's a new language and you get to give yourself grace. Does that make sense, guys? Okay. That's your little, you know, come to Jesus moment, I guess. You have to be able to follow your gut. Exactly. Trust your intuition. You know how to rock this business. If you didn't, you would not be here. You need to trust that you're capable. Fair enough? Just put the word fair if that's okay. Okay. So right here. Yes, we very much give you everything that you need. <laughs> yes, right here. This is our script. We're going to dissect it here in a moment. Okay, right here. When you go to this link, you also have clonable videos that you can mimic. Yes, I'm not kidding. Please just clone them. Copy, paste, profit. Okay, copy, paste, profit. Don't try to reinvent the wheel. Do what works. Okay. That doesn't mean you have to go get a teleprompter and say something verbatim, but take the concept of what's being talked about in these videos, non-speaking and speaking, and actually use it with your own flair. Trusting yourself that even though your first few videos look like crap, even though you feel awkward, you are still here because you know you're capable. 
Make sense? Okay. So right here, when you click this hyperlink, again, for those on the replay, it's in the description beneath this video, you have your speaking videos and your non-speaking videos. Tell it to me straight. How many of you guys lean on a crutch with non-speaking videos? You're like, oh, I'll just, uh, you know, dance in the background and put some text on the screen. Margaret to the punch. Who else? Who else is bold enough to admit it? Okay, now listen. There's no problem with you doing non-speaking videos. But think about it for a moment. Did you enroll yourself by seeing one to five to 10 non-speaking videos? Or are you here right now because you saw someone speak to you? They said something in a video that stood out. They messaged you directly. They sent a voice clip, something that actually formed connection. Make sense? Just think about that for a second. It was probably a speaking video. The little marketing videos that work, that do not speak, it's, you know, you in the background doing something, you cooking dinner for your daughter and, you know, you have text on the screen, you point at it, whatever. All those things work so well. Catherine is like the prime example of non-speaking videos. Go freaking stalk her. You're welcome. Um, but she also does speaking videos where she really connects with her audience. So if you haven't pulled out that phone yet, because you're like, I don't know what to say, hurry up and, and feel like a dummy. Hurry up and say the wrong thing. Hurry up and feel awkward as heck. You guys should see my videos from two years ago. It's embarrassing. I'm like, why do I talk like that? <laughs> why am I saying that? Why is my face like that? I mean, all, all of it. But the only way to develop the skill set to pay you big is to do it anyway and to stop overthinking. People want connection. They don't want a robot. You're here because of a connection, an actual connection with someone. Make sense, guys? So you have your non-speaking videos. Okay. We've got four in right here. We'll actually put some more in this week. Okay. But four of them, these videos right here that you're looking at. Thank you, Catherine, Kylie, and Abby. These non-speaking videos are text on the screen. They pull at some type of emotion. They engage, their eyes are up, things like that. Right. And then the text on the screen is literally, literally text and phrases from the script that we're about to share with you. So what we're talking about tonight is how you can use the words in the script to then put it in a non-speaking or a speaking video, still following the four point formula. Make sense guys. Let me know. And these right here, these variations, okay. You can make them different. You don't have to literally clone exactly what Catherine does right here, where she says, I don't think you get it. What if you started out by saying, how come you're not listening? I mean, you could say the same type of thing without saying that. You could edit it the way you see fit. But what you're doing is taking the concept, the umbrella of what you're seeing in these non-speaking and speaking videos and making it your own. And out of just these four, if we never added any more to this, out of just these four, I would be willing to bet a global sale, which would mean $400 to you, that out of just these four videos, you've got 12 videos minimum. Because if you edit it, if you make it just a little bit different, if you put just a little bit different, different font, different number, different pop-up, different music, you did something different in the background, instead of cooking dinner, you're dancing, whatever, it'll hit to a different person and they'll want to reach out. Make sense guys. Let me know. And then right here, let me move my little chat box right here. You have speaking videos. Okay. You got a handful from me right here. You got some from Kylie. You got some from Catherine and you got some from Abby and Daniel down here. Okay. These speaking videos are literally taken from the script, the script right here that you get access to in just a moment. Okay. These same concept. Notice what all of these things have in common. Okay. I'm not going to go into them now. You guys can watch and do them later unless Daniel wants to somehow, I don't, my computer doesn't play the music when I'm in a mic and stuff. So we might not be able to actually play one, but these videos here, they take the wording from the script, your video sales that are now that's brand spanking new from last week. 
and they dissect it in the four point formula. Make sense? What I want you to do and what I encourage you to do is observe what's being said, yes, but also observe what's not being said. Mine, for example, my daughter's in the background for a few of them. So who am I attracting when I show my daughter in the background, even if she's just, you know, walking around and whatever? There's a video in here that she pushes her car down the big track. You can't see it, but you can hear it. It's hilarious. <laughs> There's a piece where she like goes like this with one of her toys. And it's like, I have a toy on my face for a second. I just kept recording. Why? Because my avatar is parent. My avatar who I want to work with is a mom. Does that make sense guys? Another thing to notice, and this is just my personal tangent for what I keep talking about connection. If you look at these videos here, all of them are making eye contact. They're looking up. They're not looking down at their little thumb to hurry and press the next thing. Look up, look up, look up, look up. If you want to stand out on Facebook, TikTok, and Instagram, you got to stand out by doing opposite what you see. Follow for more. Nope, we don't say that. We give a very clear call to action because follow for more, like this video, share if you got value, but that doesn't make you stand out. That makes you blend in with everyone else. And it's the same thing with eye contact. I'll take it. I'll take it to my grave. If you make eye contact, you look up at the camera lens, just like I do when I teach on zoom, I'm looking at the camera lens. I'm not looking at myself. I'm looking at the camera lens. I'm looking at you guys right here. I'm making eye contact. Look up. It'll make it connecting for people. It'll make it so they remember you. And who is remembered gets rewarded. If you can brand yourself to actually connect with people, you'll win better. Does that make sense so far? Any thoughts about what I just said or what I've said up to this point? Hurry and drop it in the chat before I continue on, okay? Just and a quick we'll note that um, I, I want you guys to realize that like what you have in the background when you're doing your videos can be very, very, very beneficial to your content because you can say a lot without saying a lot, you know, whether, um, you know, as an example, like my, my bookcase back here, or if I'm flipped around and I have my, my stuff, my microphone and my camera and my, and my laptop, and you don't even need to have all that stuff guys, but just what you have in the background, you can say a lot without saying a lot. It can, it can let your viewer know more about you without having to say anything. So just think about that in your content. Think about that in your videos. And and by all means, every video doesn't have to be perfect. Sometimes the best videos are the ones that are real and raw and you shoot from the hip and they maybe, yep. maybe they're emotional or maybe there's some like excitement in your voice or whatever it is, but you can do a lot with a little. Yep. And for those of you out there who are like, but I don't have a home office and I'm not making full-time income like Daniel. So I don't have the fancy this and that to show in the background. Okay. Show that you're at work, show that you're on the bus, show that you work at Walmart, show that you just clocked in, show something that's relatable because it's not the people who have already made it, who get sales. They had to start somewhere too. It's also about relating with your audience. Oh my gosh, I have to clock in again today. If you were to show that you're clocking in and you are still doing a side hustle, do you know how many people would be like, oh, me too. Wait, you can do this with a full-time job. You can do this with three kids. You can do this with crazy dogs. You can do this with, you know what I'm saying? What you have in your background, the movement, think of it like a movie trailer. Why do you go watch the movie? Why are you excited for the release date to a movie when you're seeing a trailer? Because they capture your attention because there's no random awkward pauses between clips. It hops to the next, hops to the next. There's trial, there's error. There's a celebration of some sort. Same thing with your short form videos. It's literally a movie trailer. Does that make sense? Let me know. And Rashila, I'm not sure your question that you asked a few moments ago if you could reward it for me, let me know. <laughs> you said fast start one TFT videos. I'm not sure what that means, what question that means, I guess. And yes, Rachel, um, TikTok shuts things down all the time, all the time. TikTok is also one of the best platforms to go viral on because you could have one video take off out of nowhere, surprise the crap out of you, and you could land 10 sales. 
It's just about rebounding your ball. If ever TikTok shuts you down, they say, oh, I got to take down this video because you're a scammer. If they blow your account, if whatever, appeal it, rebound your ball. Make sense? Um, says, I was asking where these videos located in Fast Start Guide 1 or 2. We'll actually put it in Fast Start Guide Part 2. Um, well, give or take tonight, if not tomorrow. Um, Daniel and I actually talked about that, so you're telepathic. Um, we will have it in fast start guide part two under short form video training, where you have the button for additional videos to clone. And then you have the video sales letter script of what we're sharing right now. Does that make sense? Yep. Kylie says account warnings every single day. Cool. Challenge them. They have no idea what they're doing. Their algorithm is psycho, but their algorithm can also work in your favor. So rebound your ball. Do you guys get what I mean by rebound your ball? Any basketball fans out there? <laughs> the team who rebounds their ball after they miss, they have another chance to score. If you don't rebound and you suck at defense and you just let the team go down the court and they go score, you're not going to, you're not going to win, right? You got to rebound your ball. You shoot, you miss, you rebound the ball. You keep shooting, you keep shooting. Make sense? Okay. So let's dissect this a little bit. Um, I'm not going to read all of them. Okay. I'm going to take it in chunks and I'm going to ask you guys, kind of like we're back to school, where you would say a hook is out of this right here. What pieces would you say are a hook? And I'm not going to read it. You guys can read it yourself. What would you say is a hook? A hook, just as you guys are thinking and looking at it, a hook is what makes the viewer stay. It's three to five seconds of your short form video that make them pause and be like, who is this Lori chick? Oh my gosh. Who is this David guy? Wow. I really got to stop on what's her name, Catherine. Oh my gosh. What is she saying? What makes you stand out? What makes them stop their scroll? Just like a movie trailer. The first scene is not how everything fell together and they got married and kissed and stuff. No, they start out with a fire. They start out with she's in labor. They start out with something that makes you stop and watch. Make sense? Let me throw a quick uh, blanket statement out there because a lot of you guys are commenting the same thing, but uh, don't just follow the trend because there's no wrong answer here. Um, when you look at what she has highlighted there, there's multiple, multiple, multiple mm -hmm. hooks riddled throughout that. And any of them could grab somebody's attention depending on how you ask it. So yep. there's, there's no, it's all what sticks out to you. But I can tell you from experience, there's multiple, multiple, multiple hooks all throughout that first section there. Yep. And also, you guys, when you're doing your short form videos, especially the talking ones and text on screen, if you're like pointing and doing whatever in the background, obviously do not have this many words on the screen. <laughs> Please edit it, chop it up. So, for example, here's an example in the next few minutes. Ooh, I would hate that. As, as the first three sentences, if I was trying to find a side hustle and I came across Catherine's content, I just keep using her as an example because I can see her. Um, if I came across Catherine's content and she's like in the next few minutes, I'm like, oh crap, I don't have a few minutes scroll, right? Think of it from the viewer perspective. In the next 15 seconds, I'm going to show you how to never be scammed again. You want to make that money right from your phone and you didn't have the techniques to start. So you end up feeling slammed and scammed into things that don't pay you. Ever been there before? See how I didn't say, has this happened to you? Does it feel familiar? I'm saying something different, but I'm saying the same type of concept, okay? In your short form videos, do you want it to be where it's snippy, where it is attention grabbing, it hops to the next thing and it ties it down. Does that make sense, guys? Let me know. Okay, and then we'll just hop right here. For example, here's another quick example of a hook. If I could guarantee your success to make money online, would you pause and watch this video all the way through? If the answer is yes, blah, 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 right? That would be a hook. And the reason that's a hook is because you talk about online, you talk about making money or income, and you're pausing to say, 
If the answer is yes, but if the answer is no, please, for, for all, bye, right? You're making it so it's FOMO. It's not for everybody. You're challenging the person. Does that make sense, guys? Let me know. Okay, so right here, for example, let's just do this. this these two paragraphs, in my opinion, are all about buildup and all about value. That's the second and third piece of the four-point formula. If I could squash the pondering, the doubting, the debating about how you can make money online, and I could show you a proven way, a proven formula that guaranteed your success to lock in weekly paychecks every Friday sent to you, what would stop you from starting with me today? You know what I'm saying? Now that was a short form video, but do you guys catch my drift? Like you guys listening right now, do you catch what I'm saying here within these two paragraphs because what's the really, hook, go ahead. Sorry. Sorry. What's, what's really important too is, is for you guys to realize that you guys can ad lib. It yes, doesn't, please. it doesn't have to be verbatim. It does not have to be word for word. You can take stuff. You can mix it up. The whole point is here. Like if, if you took this entire script and I know I'm putting the cart before the horse here, but you could take this entire script and have content for the next 90 to 120 days just by taking things and mixing them up and, you know, regurgitating them a bunch of different ways. There's so much content here. It's ridiculous. Yep. And that's what I mean when I say the, just the four non-speaking videos that you guys have access to at the top of this document that we'll share with you in a moment. Even just that would be at least a dozen different videos because if you regurgitate it, huh? I know you guys love that word. If you form it in just a teeny bit of a different way, you use just one word different, you put a different font, you have a different sound, you do something different in the background that insinuates something that maybe the other video didn't, you could literally have endless pieces of content. But as I said a moment ago, do you trust yourself enough to see what's in front of you or are you doubting? right? Now going right here. Okay. In the script, obviously we do some testimonials right here. That would be a hook. You guys can quickly read, right? Right here would be a buildup because you just said you could make 50 bucks. You could make a $400 commission. You could have this and you don't have to purchase uh, this, 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 this stock inventory, bug family and friends, whatever kind of like eh, that people don't like, tie it down. You could be locking in weekly paychecks. You could have access to a system that could produce 20 to $400 sales. And if I told you, you didn't have to own your own products, you didn't have to stock inventory. You didn't have to bug family and friends, whatever you want to say, whatever the pain point is, have that be part of the buildup. And then the value presented could be right here. My, but instead of R, okay, own the responsibility, make it about you, your brand, your image. You can say our business model, or you could say my work at home business model, my work from home position, my, right? I guarantee your success. I, not we, who's we? They're watching you. They're like, who's we? I don't know. Oh, she's a team builder, blah, blah, blah. And then they scroll by, right? Take the authority positioning, okay? Here's to you. One, one quick example. If you show yeah. the folder with the videos in it and specifically the speaking videos yeah, uh, with examples from the script, I don't, I don't know which one it is, but Catherine, um, I think it's the one. Is it that one? The darker one. Yeah, I think so. Uh -huh. She- she literally like owns it, like absolutely owns it and talks about like, you know, my proven formula, my, my app, all this and everything. Exactly. It, it's like, don't be afraid guys. Don't be afraid to own it. Don't be like, I use an app. That's really cool. Like, no, own it, make, make it about you. Exactly. Yeah. I'll give you my custom app for earning and learning on the go. Right. Not so my team and like this other guy named Daniel, like, Obviously, you're not using Daniel's name, but make it about you. It's your brand. It's your business. You want those weekly paychecks just the same as you producing content for the people who also want that, right? So own the authority positioning. Be okay about that. Make it about you. Make it remembered, okay? 
Um, this one right here, I know I for sure did a short form video on, to be honest, I don't remember which one it is, but even just this one sentence, unlimited residual income for life. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Pretty sure it's that one. My daughter's like laying right here on my chest and then she moves and does something. And I don't know what she was doing, but I talk about the four point formula, whatever it says in there. Literally, I took one sentence and said, what can I create out of that sentence? And what do I want them to do at the end? about unlimited residual income. I tied it down at the end and said something like, I don't remember, you want residual income for life, go to blah, blah, blah.com so I can chat with you directly. Let's see if this is your fit. Tie it down. Don't just say go to that, that, that dot com. Go to work with Catherine.com. They're like, who the freak cares? Why do I need to go there? Oh, because I'm going to get to chat with her directly. Oh, that's her personal number. She's going to text me. Wow. Okay. I'm going to take it seriously. Does that make sense, guys? Let me know. Okay, and then right here, lots of value. You guys can see this. You guys can read it. If I had to read it, we'd be here for like another hour. <laughs> but our free system includes done-for-you websites, blah, blah, blah. All of this, this whole chunk would be the value, but own it. I will do the email follow-up for you. I will send out the professional this. I will help you with marketing. I will teach you for free. Sure, it's our team doing it, but you own the business. It's your affiliate link. Act like it, okay? Every single Friday, like clockwork, that's an easy value piece, easy. If I could show you a way to lock in a weekly paycheck every single Friday afternoon, have extra income, would you want in? If the answer is a resounding yes, stay to the end of this few second video so you can go get fully informed. Blah, 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 blah. Make sense, guys? I'm like popping out all these <laughs> short form videos. <laughs> uh -huh. uh, let's see. Income that comes in, whether you're working or not, that's an awesome buildup, okay? Completely done for you, ready to go business in an app that pays you commissions for life. That's so freaking awesome. There's a video in here from me somewhere. I don't remember where, to be honest. One of these six videos that specifically talks about, I think my hook is something like, I can't believe I'm going to give you a free money-making app. That's my hook because the app is free and I can't believe I am giving it away and I'm excited. And when you watch that video, I'm walking to the side of the house, like, well, inside the house, like I'm walking to a window. You can see there's movement in the background because it's like a movie trailer. There are some of my videos that, yes, I'm just sitting there. And there are some of the videos inside of that clone folder that I'm walking around. I'm moving. That I'm doing something, right? Uh, let's see. Done for you, blah, blah, blah. You guys can see this. Anything specific that stands out to you, Daniel, feel free to stop me. Yeah, you actually just went by it. It was back in the same section you were just in. But I, one of the things that I, I share all the time is like, you guys got to realize, and this is for you, but you can also use this as content as well. The funnel team system. So our app, our follow-up emails, you know, the sys the whole uh, team site, linking it all together, all that stuff, guys. It literally costs me personally $1,600 a month to run. It's yours free. So you can use that in, in your content. Be like this money-making system, this money-making app, this residual un unlimited residual income system costs $1,600 a month to run. I'm going to give it to you for free just for getting started. You could twist that up so many different ways. Yep. But it's also the truth and you can use it. It's real. Like yep. there's so much stuff in here that you can use. Is that helpful, guys? Just that, I mean, even just that one little tidbit. Are you like on fire right now? <laughs> yes, yeah, sure, babe. Okay. Instant communication. Okay, so let me just pause on this. Real-time instant communication. When you give a call to action that says something like, go to work with Lori.com. Lori, I can see you. That's why I keep using your name. Um, when I say that in my video, if that's my website, 
I 110% want it to be tied down for why they want to go to that link. Again, think of it from the viewer perspective. If there are multiple, multiple people on TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, who are doing the same type of yeah, 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 side hustle stuff, just like you, different company, different business, different whatever, and you don't stand out, what's going to make you stand out by tying it down? You can still have a punchy call to action that says go to workwithcatherine.com if you want to chat directly to lock in those weekly paychecks. You know what I'm saying? Tie it down just that like one little sentence more for why they why they even want to go there. Because if you just say go to my link, how do you stand out? Everyone in their dog says, oh, link in bio. Oh, go to my link. Da, da, da. Like that doesn't make you stand out. Make sense? Let's see. Copy paste profit. That's a really good phrase. I love that. You guys should be using that in your content. If I could show you a way to copy and paste your way to profit, getting paid every single Friday afternoon, working alongside me as I teach you for free how to run an online business from your phone, what do you want in? If so, drop me a comment. I only have three spots today. Blah, blah, blah. Make sense? Sooner you get good leads. Da, 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 da. Um, Anything right here, for example, that talks about community, that talks about training, that talks about even right here, we have a question and answer thread. You guys could literally be showing that. Show the Facebook group. Seriously, show the TFT training. When you say, I'm going to help fast jump your success by giving you access to this guide, show it. Just don't show the URL. <laughs> uh, but show it. It, almost like a back office tour, like a little, like, this is what it looks like. This is what I'll send you. This is what you get instant access to as soon as you enroll. You want to open up a business today? Drop me a comment. You want to open up a business today? Send me a text message. Make sense? Notice we said work with you, right? That's a good one. Long-term wealth, yada, yada, yada. Even this right here, if, okay, let me be very bold. If you are a person who's like the days of hustle and grind and struggle for years to build a successful online business are over, spit it out, talk faster because it's a movie trailer. Make sense? You could say literally verbatim this entire sentence, but in a short form video, you've got the three to five seconds to capture their attention, to talk to a brand new person who gets to and wants to take action that day with you. And even if you say it as slowly as I just did, move around, be walking in your kitchen, be closing a drawer, be doing something that makes you stand out. Does that make sense, guys? Let me know. Let's see, without creating your products, without creating website, customer service, don't have to worry about product de delivery, no stock and shelves, no bugging family and friends, no hoping out Helga does it, da, 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 whatever kind of joke you want to throw in there. The reason these are important are because they are pain points. You ever been in a system where they say they're going to help you and they don't, they're making all the money and you're not. That ends today. Stay on this video for blah, 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 blah. Okay. Uh -huh. Then we talk about GFU, what you get when you partner with us, lots of value, lots of buildup in there, all these sections that I'm scrolling by, okay? Scarcity is a really good section. Scarcity can be in your content, especially when it comes to the beginning and the end of your videos. I just launched a brand new tutorial, only 20 minutes long for those who are serious about making hundred bucks a day, extra from your phone, blah, blah, blah. But you make it scarce. It's not for everybody. Those who are serious, those who really want it. If you could help yourself with an extra hundred bucks a day, does that make sense? You want to tie it down to where it's exclusive. It's scarce. It's not something that you're just like, hey, anyone and everyone, will you please hit my link? No, what makes you stand out? that you'll help the people who are serious, okay? Lots of scarcity. All of this, by the way, okay? Um, right here where it talks about YouTube University, these courses, Social Mastery Blueprint, Scalability Pro, all of those things are literally given 
in your content, you could be saying those things. Today, I'm going to give you three different courses that allow you to monetize, scale, and build your business alongside me. I could sell them, but instead I'm going to give it to you for free. Tie it down to why it matters and that will help. Okay. And these ones are literally in your, um, oh, it's in the what to do when you get a sales section of your TFT training. It's what you copy and paste to someone who enrolled. Make sense? Let me know. Just drop the word make sense. I know we're going over a lot. The guarantee, the guarantee is super, super important. Yes, in your first seven days, if you apply what we teach and you don't get the value, go get a refund. That literally is in the script, in the video sales letter. Why? Because we want people to be confident in our confidence and why we provide a refund. The only reason we can provide a refund is because we know it will work. If we didn't provide a refund, we were just out there to hurry up and get people's money. That doesn't give confidence to the viewer who's seen your content, right? Tie it down. I guarantee your success. Here's why. Does that make sense, guys? I know I keep asking that. just want to make sure you're making, you know, making sense for you. Uh, value about uh, GFU. Okay, these, all of this right here is literally talking about the four pillars inside of GFU without saying, so GFU has been around since, you know, you're not a robot. You're not the information customer service person. You can talk about the four pillars and make it attractive and good without being customer service language. And that's what the script goes over right here. Okay. Guarantee your success. Let's see. Everything you need to finally win online. The reason I like this sentence is because the word finally picks that a pain point. You've been here before. You've been slammed and scammed. You don't know how to do it. You have been lost before you even start. You feel paralyzed. The dude doesn't help you, blah, blah, blah. Now you can finally win online because I'm going to blah, blah, blah for you for free, handling this, helping you with that instant communication so you can lock in hundred bucks so you can get a daily sale so you can whatever kind of value, okay? And then call to action. You guys know call to action, okay? Let me just unshare my screen here for a moment. Actually, I'm gonna share it with you guys so you have it. Hold on, let me see. Oh, I can't. You guys are blocking my view, all your cute faces. Hold on. There you go. Uh, okay, I'm going to unshare. I'm going to share this in the comments right now so you guys have access to it. And again, for those on the replay, the document that we just referenced that entire time is underneath the description, right underneath this video. Okay. Your call to action, just like I've been saying this entire time, please make it stand out. I don't know how many of you guys, if you even are, are saying something like link in bio, go to my link, follow for more. Everyone and their dog does that on social media platforms, especially when it comes to short form videos. And if you're doing something like that, there is no urgency. You do not stand out and we want you to stand out. You got here today, not because you followed someone, follow for more, you like the video, right? You got here because someone specifically said, Text me directly, go to my funnel so I can help you go to this link now so we can chat one-to-one. -one. I guarantee it. Make sense? Okay. So we're coming up to the hour here in just about five minutes. What questions can I answer for you now? Just drop them in the comments. Don't take yourself off mute. Ask something specific so I can give you a specific answer in the next couple minutes about what we no. talked about tonight. While you got questions coming in, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, uh, I want to share my screen and I want to show something that you guys can do. And this is a really great little hack that I've been doing works really, really well. So we've given you guys like the scripts that you guys can use, right? Mm -hmm. So you have the scripts, you have the videos that you can follow along. Here's another thing that is kind of hard to kind of put into that, but let me just show you exactly what I'm talking about. Right. A lot of times people want like, um, what does that say? Can you hear me? Okay. Yeah. Yep. All right. That was weird. Anyway, I just got a little pop-up thing that says like, you are not connected. So anyway, this is two cool things about our VSL here. Um, number one, I don't know if you guys knew this, but if someone watches the VSL and let's say they get pulled away, 
they get interrupted, they're kids, they're at work, whatever. The VSL is going to pick back up right where you left off. You can obviously click and drag and you can start at whatever point you want. But if you exit off the screen and you are at the three minute and 15 second mark, like it is right here, the next time you open up the page, it's going to be exactly at that same point that you left off at, which is really cool. Now, here's what's cool is I'll use uh, Kylie as the guinea pig right here. Okay. You could do one of two things. And I've done this in videos already, short form content. And I'll said, so you might be asking yourself, does this system actually work? Let's see what some other people have to say. And then I'll flip my screen around and I'll say, and I could say something like Kylie netted 30 sales in her first two weeks. And then I could go to the next testimonial or the one before that, which is Catherine. Catherine made over $1,500 in seven days. Or what I could do is I could even hold the, you know, hold the phone or I could turn the volume up and I could play it and let that be said as part of my short form piece of content. So they hear somebody other than you, they hear Kylie, they hear Brogan, they hear Kirsty, they hear Catherine, you know, as they're going through, like you could literally show some of the results that people are getting because every single testimonial has their little thing, you know, 30 sales in X amount of time, $1,500 in seven days, whatever it is, $3,200 in my first 10 days, whatever it is, like you guys could be using that in your content. So not only that, you also have the entire sales page visually, everything that is in the script, okay, is also written out on the sales page, not exactly every single word, but pretty darn close. So you could be showing that you could be showing like, look, you're going to get this. This is a $500 value. You're going to get absolutely free. This is a $700 value. You're going to get it absolutely free. You could be visually showing people the sales page while you're making your content as well. So yes, utilize the script. Yes. Utilize the done for you videos, but also utilize the sales page itself. So if you have the ability to use a tablet and a phone, a laptop and a phone, a computer and a phone, and show what you're talking about, that will be super helpful as well. Yep. And that's what I meant at the beginning as well, is anything that you have access to, like the video sales letter, like the script now, all the clonable videos that you have under the Fast Start Guide Part 2, et cetera, all of those things at your fingertips are endless pieces of content, oodles of content that you could be using. It's just a matter of you wording it, you following the four point formula, you acting as if it's a movie trailer because it is what makes them want to go to the release date of the movie that they just saw. Well, it's the same thing with your short form videos. A person takes action based on what they remember and how they were impacted. If your short form video blends in, there's no impact. How to make it impactful is to do as we have talked about tonight, where you're following the four point formula, you're tying it down to what matters why you just said what why does it matter what you just said so what they can work at home everyone and their dog is saying that on short form videos why do they want to work at home make sense any thoughts questions let me know i'll stay here for another like two minutes if you guys have any specific questions about what we discussed tonight hey what about this hey what about that i mean what, whatever comes to mind any tie down that you need let me know um, and then, of course, this replay will be on teachabletuesdayreplays.com, teachabletuesdayreplays.com. Um, just make sure that you actually utilize it, okay? It's all about going and doing as you've been taught. It's great information. You're like, oh, yeah, that makes sense. She's right. And when, you know, I got here because of this, that's great. But are you willing and able to do it for someone else and be consistent in that production? If the answer is yes, you're going to succeed. If the answer is no you are going to attract fence sitters because that's what you're doing yourself. Does that make sense? Um, is there a good way to use the countdown on the video sales letter? 100%. Use the video sales letter, put out a piece of content. If it says that there's, you know, two days, three hours and 42 minutes, just say my income accelerator, uh, love that word. My income accelerator expires in two days. The 31st, the, 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 the this. Because then it also is remembered when they go to the sales letter. She's like, oh, shoot. She just said it expires two days from now. She's right. Oh, crap. Got to take action, right? It's just, it all comes together like a circle, okay? Um, What other, what other question? Libby, awesome to have you. How to best respond to those signing up as a provisional user? Do you mean the free sign up, Libby? 
What's the best way to say to them to actually get them to pay? Um, that you have to actually opt into a level in order to start a business. You can't get for free and expect to run a business because they don't, they don't get anything if they don't actually purchase, but make sure your content Libby is specifically saying that they're opening a business. You could specifically say it costs $130 to get started. I'd encourage that if you're having people think that they can start for free. I would just start your content saying, well, not start the actual piece of content saying it's $130, but hey, if I could help you lock in weekly Friday paychecks all from home, working right from your phone, and it only cost you $130 one time, would you want in? Just start including that in your content so people can stop with the I want free stuff. Awesome, guys. We will see you inside the Facebook group here in a moment. Go to the featured pinned announcements. Find the post about Teachable Tuesday. Comment what you learned. If you want to collaborate, we'd love it. And then catch this replay whenever you wish at teachabletuesdayreplays.com. It'll be uploaded here within the hour or so. I hope you got value from it. We'll see you in the Facebook group here in just a few. Thanks, guys.